What it is, y'all already know, Street Fame podcast interview. I got Pretty Image in the building, man. They they doing real big things right now. But for y'all who don't know, I'm going to let them go ahead and introduce themselves to y'all. What's up, you guys? My name is Miss Attitude. And I'm Baby Girl. And, and we, we are, are Pretty Image. Image. We started singing and rapping and dancing ever since we were five and seven years old. But we officially started our group in 2016. And yes, we are from Clearwater, Florida. Yes. <laughs> All right. So uh, since 2016, yes. Yes. Who, who idea was it? It wasn't it was right. Like, yeah. <laughs> well, yeah. Because it was on my sweet 16th birthday, and uh, we did like a song and a dance, had little backup dancers, mm -hmm. and that's how it all started. And people wanted more music from us, yeah, they liked so it. we just continued. And what song was that? It was Fame. called Fame. Right. It was our first, our song, first ever. song ever. Oh my god! How y'all feel when y'all go back and listen to Fame? I'd be like, <laughs> I don't. I'd be like, I'd be like, we came I, a long way. Cause yeah. I mean, everyone still loves yeah. it. Yeah, but, but I, I think like, we came a long way. It did what it needed to do at the time. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So after Fame, that was 2016, and that's when y'all really felt like y'all had a talent or a passion to go for it. Yeah. yeah. So a lot of a lot of. At that time, y'all was a lot younger, right? Yeah. And a lot of younger people, usually their parents kind of try to push them in one way or the other. Did y'all have to experience any of that? Um, no. um, I mean, it was okay. When we went to our dad, and when we first did the song, he took it more like like serious than, serious than we first. did at first yeah because we wasn't we was just playing around we was just you know just but he did tell us if y'all want to do this y'all gotta be serious yeah. about it y'all so can't play around everything when i say everything, everything into us it still is so like so yeah all right so so basically y'all dad is y'all y'all management mm -hmm. like he pretty mm -hmm. much behind everything yeah um have y'all got offered any deals at any point yet yeah all someone right. did ask about us but my dad said that he wants us to stay like Oh, like independent some, individuals or some crap. Independent, independent artists. Yeah. So I was like, okay, cool. He was all like, right. you get more far when you're independent. He knows all about the music business because he's been doing music too. Gotcha. He did music, so yeah, he knows everything. <laughs> That's good. That's real good. So y'all, y'all are biological sisters too. Yes. Okay. One of y'all older. Mm-hmm. Okay. <laughs> um. So if anyone listens to the music, I'm gonna tell you what I took from it. Um. You still kind of got a baby voice a little bit. Yeah, I know. do. But you, you know, you said you it's talk, so, you talk. I do. Yeah, she has a baby voice. She's talking about talk. But you know, I could kind of tell from listening to it that she's the older Yoda. one. Mm -hmm. But and it's not, it's not. I mean, it's like y'all kind of equally talented to me though. When I was listening to the lyrics and actually dissecting the music, it sound pretty much on the same level. You just got more of a baby, baby voice, voice and probably more of a baby face too. But <laughs> at the same time. Yo, sister, like, um, what I heard with you, it, it sounded a little bit more aggressive and kind of like a, um, you know, like, more like, what's her name? I can't think from 3-6 Mafia. Mm -hmm. Late, what's her name? I can't think of her name, but she rap a little bit more aggressive. And, My and dad probably would know. He knows it, everything. I, I know her name. It's the same. Uh, Gangsta Boo. Okay. I heard so, that. so, I mean, that's kind of old school, but she kind of got, like, a more aggressive style. And when I hear your your voice, I hear like a more aggressive. Y'all kind of saying the same thing, but you have more aggressive delivery. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And uh, that that's good to have that because y'all got to distinct from each other. Y'all are sisters, but it don't have to be sounding the same. Y'all do got to If y'all ever do want to do, you know, features or whatever, y'all got to have y'all different sound. Yeah. You mm -hmm. feel me? Yeah. So being a female group, uh, that's important right now mm -hmm. because it's not a lot of female groups. It's mm -hmm. a lot of females starting to come up now. Yeah. yeah. But a lot of people can't keep it together as far as a group. Yeah. And, and really the only real group is City Girls. Yeah. Yeah, right now, yeah. So definitely I think that y'all, y'all in that's the That's literally avenue. the only group in yeah. it besides Beyonce. Yeah. Uh, the, what's their names? Back then, when they had the, yeah. yeah, the sisters. I, I forgot. Their oh, name, you talking about Chloe and Halle? Yes, yeah. Chloe and Halle. But they yeah. don't get a lot of credit. Like you yeah. never see them yeah. on nothing. Yeah, not it's outside of Beyonce yet. Right. But you know, but they mm -hmm. they go they gonna cook up because they already been out there long mm -hmm. enough. But yeah. um, as far as like I said, female groups. So it's not a lot of female groups, and a lot of times females can't get along. Yeah. Whether, whether they be sisters or not, mm -hmm. just can't get along. So how do y'all keep it together? Um, I mean, no matter what we go through, we're still sisters yeah. at the end of the day. Yeah. So y'all don't always agree on the same music or the same song or 
We don't like ever like argue, argue like that. Like of course we have like I, we know, have our times. Situations, yeah. But like but at the end of the day we still sisters and yeah, we still gonna come together. We don't argue and, and do your and crazy crap. Like that. <laughs> that's good. That's good. That means y'all gonna stay together. That's good. Yeah. Um and and when y'all make y'all music, do y'all come up with it together or do like you go record your verse and then you come in and put your verse on it or, or is it usually we go ahead together we gonna write it together? How, how do y'all usually? Alright, so the break, okay, so when we get to beat, we all hear it in the living room, and then, like, we used to write together, yeah. but we play too much. Yeah, we, we do. Too. We not gonna <laughs> get it done. We not gonna we get gonna it done. Like, I didn't give us the beat today. We'll be still on the same beat by two weeks from now. <laughs> yeah, because yeah, we, we not gonna get it So, like, we hear the beat. My sister go in her room. I go she in her room. And we write and we separate. And, and then, like, we're going the next day, we, we come together, studio. we go over it. And then we go into the studio together. Yeah. So do y'all ever be impressed with each other? Like, man, she can't. I got to uh, come to hard. Definitely. Always. I, first, I'm always impressed because she's my little sister. Yeah. So it's like, when I be hearing her parts, I know her parts. But then they're better than she know her parts. <laughs> Every time her parts come on any song, I swear to God, I'm in the camera with her parts. Like, because gotcha. I love, I'm, I'm like, damn, surprised. my sister is snapping. Like, she getting older. So it's like, her voice try trying to come yeah. in a little bit. She's I'm so trying. Tiny. I still sound like a baby. But <laughs> well, hey, I mean, you got a lane the way, you know, you sound like you. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Like, yeah. Every everybody can't sound the same, so like yeah. th that baby voice might be what separates you from a lot of people. You they know do. what I'm saying? Um, but I like that y'all basically are fans of each other's music. It's verses. Like when you hear you say you inspired, that's my little sister. Like it make you feel some kind of way. Yeah. And and she what, tell you, be anytime, what about when she outdo you though? What about when she drop a verse and you be like, man. Oh, I'll be, I'll be happy. I'll be like, man, I'll be happy. I'm like, man, that's cool. Next, next song, I'm going first. I'm going first, yeah. I'm going first on the verse. I know y'all got to compete though, cause like, you know, I got a brother that's two years older than me, and I used to rap like, and me and him used to be going at it like. I, I hear his verse. I'm like, I gotta, I gotta, you know what I'm saying? I gotta bring it next time because yeah. you, it's a competition. It's yeah. friendly competition. Yeah, mm -hmm. fun friendly competition. It's, it's really like, fun. damn, you did that. And we yeah. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but next time I'm gonna get you. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely. I'm gonna get you next time though. Definitely. But so, so y'all music. Um, I listen to like I said, I listen to a lot of y'all old music. I listen to a lot of y'all new music. I can definitely hear growth in it. You know, y'all yeah. are definitely growing in the right direction. Y'all got a few bangers right now that I would feel like it's really for like the clubs or like the strip clubs. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think one of them was like Earthquake. Earthquake, yeah. Our, our first that. twerk song, everybody loves that Everybody's song. like, y'all should have been doing something like that. I'm like, yeah. we was everybody that loves that. Was young too, so y'all yeah. need to get a little this bit older. This is our first time actually like doing cursing and all this other stuff. We yeah. were scared. Because back then in our first... Like our first album, we, we did never, not curse. We didn't at all. At all. At all. Like, we were scared. And then scared. this and album, was, we was like, we gotta go in. We gotta go hard. And we gotta was, go hard. Cold. Yeah. It was. It was. It was devastating because a lot of our fans were like. I don't know, y'all. Like y'all changing y'all style. I'm like, well, y'all understand. I'm too. We're years older. Old. We're getting yeah. older. I can't be keeping. You know, what I'm saying? I can't keep cussing out. I'm like leaving out cuss words and like bleeping them out. Yeah, I'm grown it's now, like, I feel like so. we're getting older and yeah. we're maturing. Y'all so. can't make teeny bopper songs. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like no. Because <laughs> so we, we're here. We actually have to go live and like, like talk to the fans. Let them know like y'all we getting older. So it's like, cause my it was a lot of people that was coming. They love it, but it's like. They just knew y'all. Mm -hmm. so. <laughs> yeah, yeah. They they heard something different when they heard yeah. us, like on this new album. In this new album, how long did how long has it been out? It's been out since August 14th. Okay, so came out August 14th. It still so just four came days. out. Four, yeah, four days. Four four days. days. And y'all getting some good feedback yeah. already. Yeah, it's fun. And have y'all been shooting any visuals for any of the music, or, or can we expect any visuals like for anything? Um, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So what's gonna be the first single? Um, earthquake. 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 We gotta got do a big old. We have a lot of that. a lot of people a behind that that's pushing that, that, that that um okay. single right now. So y'all think that's gonna be the one right now? That's, that's gonna be the one. one. I already know. know. That song. Everybody. Everybody like, loves that song. That's the summer jam banger. Yeah. Gotcha. yeah. Have y'all performed it? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. uh, at our album release party. And what was that? It was August fourteenth at Cabana Sands. Okay. And y'all got it. Y'all got good feedback. Everybody was, was twerking. This <laughs> <laughs> was everywhere. So, what other songs? I mean, I guess y'all. What would be like a follow up? You would say from this album to Earthquake. Like what do you mean? Like what would be a good follow up song? Like they heard tell. Earthquake. They heard what y'all can do on that. But what's the next song that y'all feel like would be a good single? Truth, Truth be told. told. Truth be told. We and go hard. We go. We go hardcore in that oh, song. Yeah. It's like. If we're supposed, we're talking about like things going around the world, like cops shooting black people. Mm -hmm. and you got city, the city not behind you. City don't support you. Like your own, like your you own can get city. More, more support in somebody. In somebody else's city, city than your own city. city. So okay. we talking about all that in a. You and us, funny. I know that. You know, I know because I mean, I'm from Tampa, and I travel the world, and I can tell you that's how it is. And it's funny because I'm like, older than y'all, obviously. So yeah. for y'all to know that already. 
that says something. And we literally was like on there cussing everybody. We was going hard. We, we was care. mad on that track. Because when I like, tell you mad. It be your own family sometimes too. Like it can even sometimes come to a show that's five dollars That's away. right. Exactly. Five dollars for a ticket. You feel me? Stuff like that. They supposed to be there. Yeah. They supposed to be all supporters. But when you make it, they gonna be there. Nah. Oh yeah. They, they <laughs> definitely gonna be in our face. That's definitely how that's gonna go. That's definitely how it's gonna go. And as far as like y'all dad, he pretty much handled all the business. But are y'all actually a label? Does he have a label? Yeah, yes. risky business. Risky it's called risky. Business. We also and got another artist too. Her name is Shadow, Shadow Session. Session. She's okay. on there too. Yeah. And she's on the album. Yeah. Yeah. Feature yeah she's featured yeah. on um okay. I Need You. It's called yeah. I Need You. Okay. So out of y'all album, like um, how many songs on the album? Seven. Seven. Okay. And out of all the songs, I'm gonna ask you first. Which one is your f actual favorite? Not what the fans like. What's your favorite? Truth be told. Okay, what about you? Earthquake. Earthquake. <laughs> she wanted to go turk. I got yeah. you. I got you. That's what's up. So, um, is I guess is on all platforms. Yeah. Okay. Everywhere. Everywhere. Mm -hmm. and, and since y'all last release, what was y'all last album? August. No, it was not August. It was a long time. It was a long time. So it's been a while. It's this, yeah, it so y'all put y'all time. We haven't been doing nothing. It was called the playlist. Yeah. It was called the playlist. It was called the playlist. The playlist. The playlist. Okay. And we was mainly like singing. On so y'all can album. sing too. Yeah. We can okay. We can sing. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's what's up, y'all. Y'all got the multi-talented. So when y'all on this album though, so y'all gonna be doing any singing on here too, or is just mostly just rapping. Mostly rap. Mostly, Mostly rap. rap. Hopefully, like, cause we're doing like a lot of features coming up. Cause a lot of people was like, like oh yeah, we want to like work with y'all. Yeah. Hopefully, we can do more singing and rapping at the same time. But this old album was mainly like rapping. rapping. Gotcha. Cause we wanted to show them that we can be diverse because on our first one. We was just mainly singing. Mainly singing? First one, yeah. On our first I, I, gotta I mean, go we back rapped and a little bit. I, yeah, we rapped a little bit. But it was. And that's when I was first rap. started rapping. Yeah. It was cause I used rap. to just sing. Cause I. I was like, I don't know if I'm gonna fit yes, in the rap. I, I was. This is how it started. It started off as my sister being in the singer, singer and, and she I was the was rapper. rapper. And I, when we started in 16, and I, my dad know he know I can sing, so he was like, okay, so if you can sing. And she, let's just try to see if she can rap. And yeah. she did a little thing. And then, and then y'all was shocked. Yeah. She shocked And then we was like, all right, <laughs> we like, let's rap. Yeah. Like, well, I mean, like, it's it's funny because, like, now music is, it ain't a lot of people that actually rap now. You know what I mean? It's yeah. a lot of harmonizing, a lot of other stuff. But it's funny that the females are rapping. Mm -hmm. Like, the dudes are harmonizing now. Yeah. Yeah, like, and same women going, like, hard. They dropping, like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. No, that's true. That's crazy. Like, if you listen to, like, Megan or Cardi or any of these females that's out there, they Erica in. Banks, like, you know what I'm saying? They out there, like, rapping hard. When you listen to, like, a boogie, he's singing. Or Drake. Drake, that's what I'm saying. Drake like, yeah. Everybody. I mean, like, a lot of the guys are not really rapping no more. Like, you know, mm -hmm. and it's funny because... I don't know too many females that's like going soft no more. Like me, if you listen to like I swear to God, unless it's like Janaiko or Summer Walker, the actual like R and B type singers. Yeah, yeah. You know yeah, what I mean, yeah. but I was I was in the club like just a couple of days ago with Nikki Natural and I heard some of her music. Same thing. She going hard. Like everybody's rapping. All yeah. the females are rapping now. Mm -hmm. yeah. So it, it's it's good that y'all are actually, you know, nothing wrong with singing. It's great. Continue mm -hmm. to do it. But y'all right now are doing what's in right now yeah like like i said the females they come in with the bars they rapping you know what i'm saying and and that's what i guess people are expecting for females because it, it's working but one thing i do like about y'all that stood out the most y'all don't sound like nobody else. that's what i'll say <laughs> at first like, i'll be so like i'll be like you know like dang people gonna act with it but they'll be like yeah we're different like we're we different. don't sound like nobody i listen to it like, I, li I actually listened to it i was listening you know, to like, words can, and everything yeah you can listen to people about oh they sound like that one rapper i know we don't sound like nobody, nobody. <laughs> no and, and that's funny because y'all from florida and a lot of times when you be from somewhere you, you sound just, like people that's what's yeah mm -hmm. yeah and when i listen to y'all y'all don't sound like nobody <laughs> so it's crazy but who inspired y'all like what female artists or male artists made y'all like want to really rap oh or was it y'all dad? Cause y'all say he did music at one point. He was an inspiration. He too. was, cause we used he to, we a, used to, when we was younger, we, we used to get on his track a little bit. Like all the kids, we used to just be singing yeah. and stuff. Yeah. But yeah. he was an inspiration. We knew all my dad's songs. Like yes. That. And we still know them to this day. That's funny. I would say. Y'all uh, grew up on that. Yeah. Megan Thee Stallion is hot now. Okay. I like Cardi. Cardi. That's what I like. It's, it's somebody for everybody. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's a lane right now, and I like that the females are starting to work together. Mm -hmm. Instead of all that hate, because I know when Nikki came out, it was like I'm the queen and bow down to me. No, yeah. And, and then you had Cardi and Nikki bumping heads. It worked for for a while, you know. It I mean? worked but, for a while. But then it came time. to a point to where that junk don't work no more. Like, yeah. Mm -hmm. Women have to unite on, on the music. Y'all yeah. can't be 
coming at each other's heads. You know what I'm saying? Because yeah. in this industry, it's already hard for women. It's already Anyways, hard for women. Anyways, yeah, to come yeah. man, A man can blow up easily off of a song. And, 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 and the song don't even got to make sense. It is at all. If the beat hard. He hit 1.2 million views. Exactly. That's what's crazy, ain't it? Yeah. When you're a woman, people actually listen to the words. That's why I said the rapping is mattering. Yeah. Cause like when I when I see women rap, I see people reciting the words, every word for word. Mm -hmm. But with the dudes, a lot of time they can just vibe to it. Yeah, yeah. You, you ain't gotta sing all the words. Yeah. You just vibe to it, and it's like with the women, you gotta actually be saying some stuff. So with that being said, who writing y'all music? Y'all write your own music. We write our own. Do y'all have any co-writers? <laughs> or y'all take all credit for all y'all? Everything. Everything. We write our we write our own stuff. Yeah. yeah. Do y'all ever get like writers block? Like uh, it's just natural for y'all. Like yeah. we, we got yeah. some. Yeah. It just flow. Yeah, so y'all hear me? I mean, it's like sometimes we be like, we be like, we be stuck. <laughs> and like with the twerk song, we didn't know. Cause we never made a twerk song like that. We was we never we know what to talk before. about. We was like, should we talk about this, this, and we just we didn't know. But then it just came to our head. I would say with y'all being a, a duo, that's the good thing about y'all could kind of feed off each other energy. Whereas mm -hmm. if it was just like one of y'all, it's kind of yeah. hard sometimes. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? So the fact that y'all can feed off each other energy is great. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So y'all don't have to worry about that. But um, as far as the the music making experience, do y'all have like a sound engineer, producer that sound, or y'all just working with a little bit of everybody? Oh yeah, it's in the family. So like Everything. our producer is Rod we got two, Rodney, Rodney and Lewis Bryant and Lewis. Yeah, okay, and they pretty much do most of y'all music. Yeah, all okay. of our music. Okay, that's <laughs> it. Yeah, we could. Or some people would send us beats. Yeah, other than that. Yeah. But y'all really, y'all pretty much. Y'all come accustomed to his y'all y'all cousin sound. Mm -hmm. So when y'all so when y'all heard this earthquake beat, it was like it took a little bit, but y'all. So yeah. who made that one? Uh, what's his name? He's from the Rise. He got um, me. Oh man. Uh, his name in my phone. Watch. I forgot his name. He definitely, he made a raw beat. <laughs> he definitely snap. I believe it's him. Wick Jones. Wick Jones. That's what it is. Wick Jones. And he's from from over there. Wick Jones. Side. And look, um, uh, what's her name? No, he's not. Lashanti. Yes. Yeah, She's. Yeah. Where they from? I don't know. I think they far. No. I think Lashanti from is it Memphis? Yeah. Something? So they sent it to y'all. They yeah. sent yeah. And they put that's the one that's putting up Hold this on. big music yeah, video. Yeah, they're they pushing behind. Song. Yeah, they're trying to get song. this song with movies, yeah. etc. So yeah. so yeah. Okay, so how do they reach out to y'all on Instagram? Or how do they find y'all? No, it's um something called the Rise. The Rise. Where all artists get on there and like you network basically and connects and everything. Yeah, okay. they made it during this pandemic and it went. It went. Yep. Crazy, it's viral. Then like. they send it to us. So, yeah. so they heard that beat. Y'all heard that beat. And then, and then. Yeah, because Lashanti was like, when we did the um interview, Lashanti was like, okay, yeah, this pretty image right here. Yeah. We're going to have to send that because it's daytime. Yeah. I like it. Mm -hmm. So, y'all, who y'all interviewed with for that? Lashanti, right? Okay. Yeah, Lashanti. Yeah, so that's who y'all yeah, interview with. with. Okay. Yeah, Lashanti. And then and then they they said we got a beat for y'all mm -hmm. and they had a sense y'all. Yeah. And y'all listened to it and y'all yeah. was like we we finna make a twerk song today. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, that's what's up. Yeah. So are y'all working with like I said I know y'all say y'all doing features, but are y'all working with like any other artists out of the city or anywhere around the world that y'all working with? Uh we worked with this man named Second Chance. Mm -hmm. We're about to work with some more people too. And uh, what's her name? Lay. Lay, she's from. I forgot. I don't know. I forgot where she's from. She's but we just take it features from any, yeah. everybody. Yeah. It don't matter where you're from. But hopefully, we finna feed. I want somebody to feature on this earthquake song, cause like it can be like a banger. Like have like somebody like Hot Boy or somebody like on the beat. Like that's a boy and just ride on yeah. So you want a guy for it? I do. Yeah. Like you know how I don't know if you heard the City Girls. Girls just want to have fun song. Mm -hmm. And um, what's his name? He's definitely. I love split. him. Um, yes. Oh my God. Mm, it's not I forgot Hot his boy. name. I got. I got. The song on my phone. Y'all bad with names. I got, <laughs> with names. I got the song well, on my phone. Don't forget me. I'm Street Fan. That's all y'all. We would remember. never. <laughs> y'all horrible with names. Oh my god. You get an interview with what's his name? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not good at. I'm not good at. I, I know how it go, but it's cool. That's yeah. what's up. Baby Soldier. Yes. Baby, Baby Soldier. Soldier. Okay. Yeah. 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 yeah I, I heard that track. I don't really be listening to like City Girls like that, but I, I like them though. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? Like. I think their music hot, but it's not manly to be like right around listening to City Girls. You feel me? Yeah. They go hard, but you know what yeah. I'm saying. If I hear it being played, you know it is what it is. But I'm, <laughs> I'm not gonna go play it. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Yeah. Mm -hmm. But that's how it is. So, so what? What artists would y'all like? What? What some artists would y'all like to actually work with? Like who? Who inspire y'all? I want to work with. I mean, I I never I never thought I would say this because like I don't know because when I first saw this artist, she was younger. But I want to work with Mulatto. Mulatto. She's starting to blow up a lot. What about Definitely. you? Definitely. Um, Chris Brown, Cardi B. 
Okay. Um, I like Chris Brown's sound. How he sound. You know, like so I love his music. But you like singing, so I mean that makes sense. Oh yeah. What What do y'all listen to besides yourselves? Janae Aiko. I listen to Rod Wave. Rod Wave. Yeah. He from the city though. I mean, he he from Iowa. Yeah. Yeah. Have y'all met him? Yeah. Mm -hmm. We did shows with him before. That's what's up. That's what's up. So y'all are doing shows. Oh yeah. With this COVID going on, how is that? Like, do y'all have anything coming up, or like, is it slowing down? So Saturday summer was supposed to be big. crazy. Saturday on the twenty second, we have a show. I think in Tampa. Then right after that show, we have we to go all the way to Atlanta. Atlanta. And then <laughs> right we got after one, that. hopefully, that it says something about Louisiana next month. So but, we got a lot. We got a lot. But this summer out. was supposed to be a tour. It's supposed to be traveling. Big. Something happened, yeah. but we're trying to, you know, pick it back yeah. up a little bit. So we got it's shows. We got some shows coming up. Oh yeah, now. So if a person never heard a pretty image ever, what could they expect? If they never heard, if they of never heard of, they well, could what could they expect to be listed as album? Like they listen to what could they expect? Growth. Growth. Yes. Okay. Because like we came a long If way. they, if we gave them a piece of our old album, our old album, and then they heard, and then they heard this one, like yeah. That's what I heard. Like yeah. I told you, I, I listened to it. I was riding around in the car listening to it. Like I was like, let me see what I can do. And, and I got like the little Android, so I, I was on YouTube and I was just going down the songs. Mm -hmm. And I was looking at when it was made. Mm -hmm. And and y'all, I mean, y'all definitely grew. Not that y'all was bad then. It just it was more of a, a, a teenage. It was a younger sound. Yeah, it was. You know what I'm saying? Sound. And we had yeah, sound. It's crazy. And then when I heard y'all like, cursing, I was like, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> they cursing. I'm like, you know, I was shocked. I was shocked too because I listened to it and I was like, the first thing I noticed that y'all didn't say any bad words. Yeah. I think y'all say like hoes or something like that, but y'all ain't say no actual cuss yeah. words. And then when I listened to some of y'all new album, mm -hmm. I was like, okay, they grown up now. <laughs> I guess we gotta leave the childhood behind. Them. Yeah, it's time to grow. <laughs> but that's that's a good transition because you know how hard it is for an artist to go from that stage to the stage y'all going to. Because most we artists, scared. most artists don't make it. Yeah, they have their time, they have their moment. Like I'm a, they be like a a child entertainer. Like Mama's Behavior mm -hmm. or like OMG Girls, if you know Lil Wayne's daughter. I interviewed him a long time yeah, ago when like, it was on. Yeah, really? <laughs> I interviewed him like nine, ten years ago. That's what's up. That was probably about, what it was like, 2009, probably 11 years ago, I interviewed him. And, and that's what I don't want to happen to us. Like, it's us funny that you even know who they are because I'm like, I thought nobody knew who OMG Girls was, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. They didn't really have a big run like they, you would think when yeah. they push that, they, you know, T.I. Yeah, daughter. T.I. daughter. Yeah. You would think you know they would still daughter. be like up. Like, you would thought with that better. push behind yeah. them that, that they would have been. Because you know they already at the top, damn that, you feel me? But uh, T.I. daughter doing her thing. She's, I mean, they she's all doing it individually, but they're not. The OMG girls didn't do what it was supposed to be. Yeah. So y'all was able to go from that teenage to to growth. And that's why and I say it's hard. hopefully, like, grow more, too, because once, you know, a little woman starts to get her woman voice, it's going to sound way different. Which... It's going to come. I mean, it's going to come with time, as long as y'all stay consistent. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? That's what it's all about, consistency. And, um, like I said, making that transition is not easy. Yeah. A lot of artists can't make that transition. So that's how I know that y'all are determined, y'all dedicated. And four years is a long time. To finally get some recognition. Yeah. I mean, y'all, people know y'all, but you know what I mean? Like, to yeah. finally get to where people take y'all more seriously. It do serious. take time. And it take time, and a lot of people give up. Yeah. You know yeah, because, I mean? you know, we be Honestly, like, oh, I my God, like bro, when is our time? Through, yeah, we had to go through, like, yes. because we were literally not taking none of the We series. wasn't serious in the beginning. And the reason why we didn't blow up is, as we was, I'm telling you, we was getting shows back to back. It was crazy. We was doing parties, and then, like, it slowed down because we wasn't even into our own we wasn't stuff. We wasn't posting. And we wasn't, and we, we really didn't even listen to our music back then. Like, yeah, so now we were like, like, we don't want, but now we so bumped our music. Now people can see that we serious. It's so like, fuck with it. yeah. That's good. I mean, that matters. I mean, if you got to show people that you're passionate about it. Because if, if you're not passionate about it, how you want me to be passionate yeah. about it? You know what I'm saying? Do y'all have any songs that y'all really tell about y'all selves, though? Like y'all story on yeah. any of y'all songs? Which one is that? Uh, it's an old one, though. It's one from my mom. Yeah. It's called it was called Dedicated. Yeah. Dedicated? Yeah. What happened with y'all mom? Oh, my mom. Her mom. My okay. Mom, sorry. Well, I had a feeling that's what you was about to say. I'm sorry to hear that. Mm -hmm. But, um, I mean... Yeah, that song was... When I first knew, I like I literally, it was I didn't tough. rap like like when I rapped, like I write and take forever. That song I wrote it in one, I think it was like an hour, two hours, 
I swear to God. And my, I was, was just, so, I sat there. It'd be tough to perform that song. Because yeah. when I see it, my sister cry on stage, we performed it like I just, three times. Yeah. And every time I performed it, the every time I see like, her cry on stage, it's like, I cry on stage. And she's trying to hold it together. Like, she's trying to hold it together. I'm yeah. looking at her. And then she's crying, and, and then I'm crying. The and it's like, oh and then my the crowd's God. like, I remember that. Like, we yeah. only performed it like three times. Because when people be like, I want to see you guys perform dedicated, I'm like, y'all, I can't. But it's more. I know, it's I know it's personal. entertaining to y'all, but to me, it's like, it's like personal. That's a song that I don't really like performing. Yeah. But, but I you, did, But though. you know the thing about it, though? Like, that's another thing when you mention Rod Wave. Like, people like to hear that stuff. Oh, we are. They, what you Because people are going through stuff, too, so yeah, they, so they, they can relate it. to it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And I know it's hard because it's, it's grown men that, that got songs like that. That when they perform it, they get choked up. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because it's a hard thing to you know deal with. Yeah. But that's good that you're even able to, you know what I'm saying, make mm -hmm. it through it. Because yeah. you're young, a lot of people, like, we ain't doing it at all. And yeah. if y'all fans want it, y'all find a way to, to give it to them. Um, on y'all set that y'all do, as far as y'all show, when people come out to see y'all, what? How, how long is y'all set? Like, it's like a, going from the past to now, or y'all giving them just what y'all doing now? Oh, we just get like we had like a, a virtual show for for the kids. kids. We gave them back. The we gave them the Y'all past. They love all the they old music. Yeah, they love music because the they're kids. It's too explicit for them. Yeah, we can't. And then we gotta bleep out all the words. Uh, and it's like, oh my god, it was so we, hard. Oh my god, we just did a show, virtual show, so and we had, to, we, had, we had to bleep out like literally. Yes, we had everything. to do the clean version of some stuff. And it killed me. It was <laughs> ready to like. <laughs> I just like, oh my gosh, I don't want to slip up and say this cuss word. And we bobbing, like, rapping. <laughs> yes. And we about to cuss, but we, like, kind of hold back. Yeah. Yeah. That, that's that's real good. Um, Do y'all have anything that y'all want to put out there for the fans who might be watching and listening? Like, um, what they can expect or what should they expect, like, from y'all coming up or just anything y'all want to tell them? More music. Yeah, more features. More shows. Y'all come out. We gonna tell y'all on our social media. We gonna tell y'all where our shows at. Y'all can come out. Y'all can see us perform. Yeah, I, more inventory too. Yeah. Um, I know we do have a, like a shoe collection out right now. Yeah. So we are trying to get like a bathing suit collection too. Yeah. So uh, we got clothes out there. Yeah. So. All right, and y'all, yeah. and for y'all, y'all have any individual Instagrams or is it just? One? It's we share. One. It's just one. Share one. Like in the, in the future, I will make my. Own. Well, I have one, but I just. Yeah, yeah, y'all just. Focus I mean, on. I had one, but then Dad <laughs> used <laughs> mine for the pretty image. So I'm yeah. like, okay. Yeah, so he kind of kidnapped. And then when I made one, he saw my account. It was like. Yeah, he took over. I was like, <laughs> Let me delete my account. That's what's up. Yeah. That, that's great that y'all dad is behind y'all because like that matters because people will take advantage of you quick in this industry. Mm -hmm. And and I know a lot of artists locally even are getting signed. Mm -hmm. But I tell them being signed don't ain't everything if it ain't right. You know what I'm saying? Because I've, I've watched a lot of artists, you know, make it here or make it there and them deals just be so crazy. Yeah. That, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's like the paperwork. A lot of artists will tell you is that if the business ain't right, no matter how good you are, it ain't gonna last. You know what I'm saying? And that y'all dad stepped up and he knows so much about it and he's taking that that step to help make sure y'all don't get taken advantage of, you know yeah. what I mean? So that's a major big up to y'all dad. Y'all wanna give y'all dad a shout out, man? Shout out to shout Risky out. Business shout Entertainment. Out. Yeah, shout out to our dad, <laughs> our manager. And he been there from the beginning. From man. the beginning. So if anybody wanna do a feature or an interview or anything, they, they need to holler at y'all dad, right? Yeah, you yeah. can go on our website, prettyimage.com. Or DM us. Yes. And our Instagram, yeah. Pretty Image. P R E T T I E M A G E. All right, so. That pretty much wraps it up. I mean, y'all said what y'all had to say unless y'all got anything. Go get the album. It dropped August 14th. Go get it. It's hot. Yeah. Popping. And definitely be looking out for this earthquake video. Yes. Period. That's our single. Video, hopefully. They yeah. Don't yeah. About me. We need we, we're we not going to forget about it. I'm just going to walk by. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm just gonna walk through the video real quick so y'all can just see me, you know definitely, what I mean? Definitely. But that's what's up, man. I appreciate y'all taking the time to come over and uh, sit down with me for a minute. And I hope everybody who's watching, y'all appreciate it because they, you know, they young and they got talent and they got a lot of potential. And it's just, I see, I see the future coming. It's bright. As long as y'all mm -hmm. stay grinding, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Oh. And I know y'all gonna do that because four years, y'all already been doing it, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. So, it's like, why stop now? Yeah. All right, make sure y'all check out our, our YouTube channel, subscribe. Make sure y'all subscribe to Pretty Image. YouTube channel, make sure y'all follow them. Um, and we're gonna keep bringing it to y'all. Street fame, we signing out in Pretty Image. Thank you so much for Thank having us. Thank you for having us. Yeah. Again, show. my name is Miss Attitude. And I'm Baby Girl, and, and we, we are Pretty Image. Image. There we go. Y'all <laughs> heard it from them yourselves.